Are you looking for an easy, simple recipe that you could cook from anywhere? Then you're in the right place. Let's get cooking. So welcome back to the series. Tonight's dinner is going to be something very simple that you could do from anywhere. Uh, I got this package of Ultimate Vegetarian Chili. It was $1 when I bought it, about a little bit ago. Um, it's 10 ounces. It's ready in 60 seconds in the microwave. Um, one serving per container. Cool. Um, I want to bulk this up a little bit. So one of the main ways I would do this normally is like put it over rice, <laughs> but I burned my pot today and I'm still scrubbing it to get all the burn off. So I'm not making rice tonight. Um, Although I could have made like, I could have bought a microwave patch of rice and done that, but that's fine. We're gonna bulk this up another way. So we're probably gonna eat it with corn chips uh, or tortilla chips. So yay, probably wouldn't have done that with rice. So happy, happy accident. Okay, other things, I'm gonna add probably some additional beans to it. Um, these are light red kidney beans. You could use pinto beans. You could add black beans or like chickpeas or like whatever beans that you like or happen to have on hand or need to use up, you could throw them in there. Speaking of using stuff up, I had opened a can of corn. We're gonna, we need to get rid of this. So we're gonna put the corn in there. Also, I have a little bit of green diced chilies. Need to use those up as well. We're gonna throw those in. And then finally, if we need some more tomato, we're gonna throw some of this uh, diced tomato that I had opened a can and this is what I've got left. So, let's get cooking. So, I did microwave. Okay, so I did microwave this for part of the time. I didn't do the whole time because I ripped the whole top off and didn't follow the directions and was afraid it was gonna boil over and be a disaster in my microwave. But you could microwave this the whole time and I'm sure you'd be really, ha really happy about that. Um, you could make this whole meal in the microwave if you use tortilla chips or if you use microwavable rice. You could also just heat up. Okay, I've got that heat a little more than I meant to have. I have been burning stuff all day today, so I'm going to try to not burn this. How's that? Okay. Cool. So we've got that. I think we want to add some additional beans to that. Okay, so this is like a half a can of beans and probably a half a can of corn also. I rinsed them. Let's mix those puppies in. Now, if you were in a hotel, you could heat the extra beans and corn separately, or if you just added a little bit of them, you could mix them in and hope that um, the chili kind of like warms it. Uh, or you could put everything into the bowl that you're gonna eat and microwave that to heat it up. That looks pretty good. Um, downfall, of course, is that I now have a half a can of beans that I'm gonna have to figure out how to use. So honestly, I think I'm just gonna add all of them because it looks like a lot of corn. I like corn, but not not all corn. Like, I mean, I like all corn, but not like, I don't want my meal to be all corn, you know what I mean? Wow, well that looks big. So we got our chili as the base, that'll be great. Now we've got this um, kind of last thing that we're going to add. Maybe not really the last thing, but you know what I'm saying. Another thing. We're going to add these dice green chilies. Maybe not a staple in chili, but like it has chili in its name, right? So maybe it is a staple. Ooh, that's going to be delicioso. And I think last but not least, we're going to add... Product. You could have also gotten like chili beans, I guess, and added it to this. I 
really like tomatoes, so maybe we'll just add a little more. Okay, I actually added all the tomatoes because there was just not enough left to rationalize not having them all in. Okay, I'm gonna let this heat for a little while. Not very long, because I'm gonna try not to burn anything else today. And, uh, and then we're gonna eat it. Yay! And there we have it. That's about half of what I made. Plus we have the tortilla chips and I forgot that I had frozen some corn muffins and so I just toasted one. You of course, if you're like in a hotel or only have access to a microwave, might not have that opportunity, but I did. And so I'm gonna enjoy that um, with my dinner as well. All right. And I guess people always like to see the taste test so we'll do it. Put my hair back because this is going to be food in my hair for sure. Tastes like chili. Excellent, easy, inexpensive. Yay! So as it turns out, that serving size was bigger than I thought it was what I made because I either wasn't that hungry or it was my eyes were not as big as my stomach because um, I couldn't finish it. But that's okay. That means I have more for tomorrow. So if you like this kind of series, go ahead and check out the rest of them that are in this series. Also, if you're looking for the corn muffin recipe, I have a video on that as well. Link that below. The nicest compliment you could give me would be to like this video and share it. So thank you so much. Hope to see you next time. Bye.